Hello, it's Jason with Hardy Life Outdoors. It is a beautiful November morning here in Southeast Ohio. I'm at the Lazy H and uh, this morning I'm refilling bird feeders. And I decided I'm gonna do a little informal experiment around the question of is more expensive bird seed more appealing to birds? Um, I've tended to buy from a, uh, I guess a premium seed provider for years and the other day I decided I was going to buy from um, a farm supply store so I picked up uh, a bag of seed from there I've got the other stuff that I always use I've got two feeders they're the same size two tube feeders I'm gonna hang them behind me up on my wire um, neither feeder is accessible by squirrels I've never had squirrel problems but um, I'm going to hang them up there closely and we're going to monitor them um, over the next couple days and see is there a preference. When you look at the two, this is the premium seed mix. And what you probably notice is um, you know, it's a much darker mix and that's primarily because there's a lot of sunflower seeds in it. This is the less expensive mix and uh, it's got some corn in it. I think it's got some peanuts in it maybe. Uh, as well as some sunflowers. But you can see that the mixes, you know, if they're marketed as being both uh, kind of premiums, um, this one looks much more appealing. But we're going to monitor this, see how quickly they go through the seed in each tube. And, um, you know, you can argue on this one that uh, there's more sunflower. So, you know, sunflower seed takes up more space and it should empty faster. But, um, We'll see. This has a good mix that uh, may appeal to more birds. So we're going to put it up there and we're going to see what happens. Okay. I don't know how well you can see them behind me, but all of my bird feeders are hung. So we're going to see what the birds think. There they are. You can see the two small tube feeders. I've got a suet feeder there. And then I've got a large tube feeder that has the premium mix in it that I always use. Okay, it's been a couple weeks and I'm back with an update on my bird seed test. The high quality, high price seed versus the seed from a local uh, farm store. So let me flip the camera around and we'll talk about what we see. Okay, start off. This is the high quality, high price seed. You can see it is about halfway full. Pan over here. This is the lower priced farm uh, supply store food. You can see it's about half full. They're both about half full. Here's the kicker. After about a week, they looked like this. So I refilled the one on the right with the high quality seed. The other one has hardly moved and they have eaten half of this. So they have eaten at least twice as much seed out of the right tube as they have the left tube. If we move on over to my larger seed tube, you can see it's about halfway. I also completely refilled it at the same time. So my two tubes that um, had the the higher quality, higher price seed, they've eaten the seed about twice as fast. So what I have done, I've taken my high quality seed and my lower quality seed, I mixed them together uh, to give me kind of a moderately priced seed, but I will be going back to my high quality seed. All right, I don't know if that was valuable to you, interesting, fun or not, but it answered some questions for me. I had always avoided the lower cost seed because I'd heard the quality wasn't there and that the birds didn't like it as much. And uh, this kind of proved it out for me. So thanks for joining. Uh, if you're interested in following along, click like, share, and subscribe here at Hardy Life Outdoors. I'll see you soon. Thanks.